as I lead the melody. So trajo to pluk, held agor morgat, sol tas flounder gat. Really? We're doing this? I think we're good without the Catathian battle songs, Drax. Very well. Man, this thing is ugly. Ah, what made you bring? Thought we could use it if we ever need to hide our identity during a job or something. First of all, a Glarnot mask ain't no identity. Glarnot? They're that gang from the Planet of the Rain's Emeralds or something, right? Or am I confusing them? It's diamonds. Oh, yeah. And B, there's only two jobs I've ever needed a mask. The time me and Groot knocked over a top-secret lab. Really? Oh, yeah. The other time was when I borrowed a Glarnot mask and accidentally stole Groot from the Collector. When did you guys rob a secret lab? Eh, it was before we came after you. This Signog named Wheeler reached out to me and Groot. Wanted us to steal a bioweapon from some research lab in Arago 7. Piece of cake for a crack team like me and Groot. <laughs> wait, wait, and Groot wore a mask for this? <laughs> Man, you should have seen him, Quill. Bark naked except for the stupid mask of Thanos. It was flarkin' hilarious. <laughs> yeah, I bet. That was until we realized the eggheads on Arago actually hired Wheeler to get us there. Uh, six out of ten times, it's a trap. Yup. Turns out they wanted to study us. My implants, Groot's regeneration, super valuable to the right bidder. By the time I realized what was up, they'd got Groot. Locked him in a frickin' cage, Quill. Like an... like an animal. Ugh, that's terrible. Yep, yeah, well, joke's on them. We weren't about to be turned into science experiments anytime soon. So, I went with plan B. One explosive charge later, and ba-boom, we were home free. <laughs> and the bioweapon? Sold it back to Wheeler for triple the price. Nice. <laughs> yup. <sighs> Those were the days. How'd you accidentally steal Groot? You have to understand, Quill. I was on the run back then. The war was still raging strong, and then Cree scientists weren't exactly happy I left Halfworld. I had to keep a low profile. By robbing the Collector? I was broke! And no offense, but the way the Collector plasters his face all over nowhere like he owns the place... He doesn't own the place. Someone had to knock him off his stupid flarkin' pedestal! Ah, uh, the fact that I was drunk when I did it just makes it funnier. Is there a, a bounty out for you that I should know about? Relax! Anyways... I lifted one of them stupid Glarnot masks from some passed-out jerk at Mantlos, stumbled my way to the Collector's Emporium, put on the mask, flashed some shiny rocks I found, and when his assistant's back was turned, I punked him on the head. <laughs> oh, you're unbelievable. <laughs> I know. It was gravy after that. Once I was sure he was out, I started cleaning out the place. Woke up the next morning on a stolen transport with a bag of loot and groat. Uh, of course, he was just a baby back then. Barely taller than a weed. Aww, baby Groot. I knew right then and there that I had to take care of him. A cage ain't no place for guys like us. We've been partners in crime ever since. That, I believe. Eh, believe what you want, Quill. Truth is truth. I'll just put this back. I don't think I've been that eager to start a mission since I worked for Thanos. You were eager to work for Thanos. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Shivering tit wishes it's cold. <laughs> That's not really how that saying goes. You want to correct me, or you want to find Fin Fang Foom and save the galaxy? I want Fin Fang Foom. And the galaxy saving thing, I guess. Assuming Hellbender even goes for this. Lady Hellbender will. Go for it. Okay. Well, I ain't seeing no foam poop. We should look for Katathian Hunt Park. Oh! 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 
legends of raining fire are true. Any other legends we should know about? Legends of glorious death. Well, as long as it's glorious. We sure will still have a ride home with all the meteors? She can take a hit. We literally just crashed. Watch out! This place is falling apart. We did not come here to be slain by ice and rocks. There is only one noble way to die on Maklu 4. Like so many of my people before us. Someone remind Drax we ain't come here to die! No one's dying! We're taking Foom alive. We're handing him over to Lady Hellbender alive. And we're getting her to help us take on the church's armada. So in this plan of ours, the armada part is where we die? Uh, maybe, but definitely not before that. Go team! Looks like a dead end. Glorious dead end. Got to admit, I kind of love how excited you are about all this. All right, Drax, let's channel some of that excitement toward this rock. Ah, I should pretend as the head of Fin Fang Foom. Great. Drax just shattered the skull of the thing we're supposed to capture. Bye-bye, galaxy. You have nothing to fear. I am Groot. Groot says he wants to take it all in. Take your time, buddy. Might be your last chance to take anything in. You think Foom's in there? If fantasy books taught me anything, it's that dragons love to hang out inside mountains. <coughs> Groot wants to know if those books said anything about catching dragons. I'm sure it had something to do with teamwork and trust. <coughs> you can't remember the details because you didn't read the whole thing. I read a lot of different dragon books, okay? And there was always a mountain, and the good guys always win. <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no one writing a book about us. I think I see something up ahead! Look, my people were here! Didn't we see these in Drax's memories? When Mantis linked us all together? The Akatathian hunt markers. That's a lot of brave Katathians. After Thanos raised Katath, my people were left broken. Physically and mentally. Their exodus led many of them here in great numbers. Uh, so how many of these hunters came back? None. They were all victims of Fing Fang Foo? Not victims. They came for the ultimate battle. A truly glorious death. Is it just me, or does it feel like we're a part of something here? Oh yeah! Part of Foom's all-you-can-eat buffet. I mean, walking in the footsteps of Drax's people, out here to save the galaxy, makes you want to believe in destiny. I'm not trying to kill the moment or nothing, but everybody listed here was destined to be monster chow. If we all die, we will die like proper Katathians. If we all die, everyone dies. Magus is gonna consume everything. Then let's catch Foom and make sure that doesn't happen. Guts are tough. Tough? I'm saying we're no slouches either. We've got plenty of scratches on our holsters to prove it, so come on. Who's with me? Do his voice We are! Scared. I really hope this Lady Hellbender plan works! We deliver food! Lady Hellbender is in our world prowess! Never see it coming! Like an ice dump version of Stumpy! No mentioning Stumpy! Remember last time? Ha! We fight in the footsteps of so many of my people! Guess that makes us honorary champions! Get ready! <laughs> <laughs> he 
said this was gonna be easy, Rocket. Right, right. But 10,000 times, Quill, Drax is the literal one, remember? Obviously, our chances of pulling this off suck. A lot. But what chance does the galaxy have if we don't pull it off? Exactly. We all saw what the Church is capable of. No matter what this planet throws at us, we're not stopping till we catch Boom and Lady Hellbender is fighting by our side. Gamora, I'm thinking I can get a pretty good vantage point from the top of this thing. Okay, just be careful, Peter. I can see the whole crater from up here. Maybe Foom's not in the mountain after all. Maybe he's down there somewhere. You tell us. I mean... If I were a dragon, I'd definitely want to stop around down there. The legends do tell of Fintine Foom stalking Maku's greatest caldera. Good enough for me. We can probably work our way around the edge and find a way down. <gasps> Flark and Hala! Whoa, get a load of them claw marks. It's gotta be Fooms, right? He's even bigger than his legend. So, yeah, uh, when we find him, let's avoid the claws. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we need to cross here, too. Just not sure how. Looks like there might be a ledge hiding under all those rocks on the other side. Okay. I'm thinking this is step one of a multi-step solution to get across this chasm. All right. And what are the next steps? Still working on that part. Incoming! So step two of your plan is crushing us all? I think I see what he's up to. Yeah, crushing us all! What do you say? Throw it? Certainly. Where shall I move it? What's with all them rectangles? Monoliths. Fine. What's with all them monoliths? It's possible they are ley lines, which may lead us directly to Fin Fang Foom. Take it away, Drax. Certainly. Where shall I move it? Toss it. Easily. Where shall I put it? I could clear the rubble from that ledge, Peter Quill. I just need something to throw. Final step, Drax. If we can topple some of those rocks... <laughs> Glorious! I swear, I've never seen you in such a good mood. Because you have never seen me on the Great Hunt before. What about our quarantine zone mission? You mean our quarantine zone bust? Drax, 
I know you've been waiting for this a long time. Enjoy it, man. Thank you, Lord Will. I must admit that with everything that has happened, I need this. Yeah, well... Everyone get ready! There's something up ahead! Pretty sure it sees us, whatever it is. Great! More boom food to deal with! Do not underestimate anything that surprises and perils of this planet. Good advice. Carve him a new one! I for one am ready for you, Finn by Boom! Love and the excitement, Trax! Just promise no avalanches! I'm worried we won't have time to save Vicky! We don't want to be saved, Quill! Hold fast! Play him down! The rest of you should think of this as a warm-up for Finvine Boom! I've never believed in warming up! Just kill fast and get out! And the hunt for Finvine Boom continues. Okay, let's just think things through a moment. When is that a thing we do? What if we're too late? What if Raker finishes what he started and the ritual... Then we're doing all of this for nothing. Not for nothing. If our final act is to challenge Fin Fang Foom, it would be an honorable final act. I don't do final acts. I'm a survivor. Let us hope we are not too late. There. See? More... ominous peaks. This planet's starting to give me the creeps. I keep thinking Foom's gonna claw us from behind. Fin Fang Foom is a legendary beast. Legendary beasts do not claw from behind. Maybe not. But smart ones do. treacherous surface to test would-be adversaries. Oh, it's Lady Hellbender Legends all over again. Well played, Kakaranthara! Careful! That's deadly gas. How do you know? Hello? She's in a... Assassin? I bet she's gassed all kinds of famous people. I have no idea what you're talking about. So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Foom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out! Cowardly. I want full credit for the kill. For the last time, Drax. We're not killing Fin Fang Foom. We're catching him to give the Lady Hellbender so she forgives us and hopefully helps us fight the church. <sighs> Seems complicated. Wait, wait, wait! Rocket, are you neck deep in water? We're about to stare down a legendary dragon with the fate of the entire galaxy at stake. I ain't gonna hold us up. Wow. I'm impressed. You really do it for fear. Yeah, well, it ain't about me. Careful. That's deadly gas. How do you know? So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Boom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out! Cowardly. Wait, 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 wait! Rocket, are you neck deep in water? We're about to stare down a legendary dragon with the fate of the entire galaxy at stake. I ain't gonna hold us up. Wow. I'm impressed. You really conquered your fear. Yeah, well, it ain't about me, no. Buddy, smash it! This shall be fulfilling!
Octopus spiders! Mark this lousy planet! Loving the initiative. So trajo to cloak. So trajo to cloak. Eldar or no dark. So Nice. Who will know it hit him? You will be more resilient than a boulder. I know. I'm just trying to be positive. Why? I think it's a team building thing. We require no further team building. Honestly? Whoa! Barking, Maklu! Maklu 4, Peter. Must be fair to the other Maklus. Nothing compared to the legendary teeth and claws of Fin Fang Fu. You know, I'm gonna be really disappointed if he doesn't live up to all the hype. <laughs> Assuming we live that long. Peter, look! There's smoke ahead. Boom! It's boom! Yes! Oh, I'm going, keep Let's going! Go you fucking rock! Yes! <laughs> Yeah, Ominous is right! Here goes! Watch out! That's a lot of death spikes! It's a good thing my skin is so resistant! Fang Foom, you seen him? Big wings, nasty teeth. Purple shorts. What do you mean, purple shorts? What, I heard he wears purple shorts. The ancient legends do tell of such a thing. See? This one. <sighs> Let's see those things in action. I'm on it. Melt that one, too. That rock tried to murder us, or we'd have never got Quill's sweet new power. Maybe we could almost kill you more often. I am so jealous right now, Quill. You should be. At least it ain't quite as cold in this cave. You're the one with fur. Groot's practically naked. Groot don't get cold, but he's a big baby in the heat. Hey, we're all flammable. What is that? Come on, Rocky. We got past your fear of water. 
That ain't water. I swear, Quill, you get all the fun toys. What? What about that weird gun you have that turns people inside out? Oh yeah, the zipper. Man, I gotta fix that thing. They've saved us three times already. I mean, how did you know they'd melt that ice wall? Oh, uh, I... didn't... So we could have just as easily died horribly. Yep. Up we go! trying to communicate. Please don't. Where'd he go? See? He just wanted to... Okay. Now we know they're all around us. Check out these pointy trees. Don't check them out too closely. Groot says watch out for those plants with all the holes on them. <clears throat> Maklu 4 is beautiful, its own twisted way. The trees are indeed twisted, well observed. Groot says the plants here are all mean or stupid. With all these exceptional beasts, it's a wonder Lady Hellbender does not move her home here. A little cold for Lady Skullsuit. Drax seems to be doing okay. But Katathians have adapted to survive long and harsh winters. And blistering, brutal summers. <laughs> no, our summers are quite mild.
This one is crying for punishment! Finally! Let me at him! playing with the snow monkeys. Wendigo. Is that really what we're calling them? Hey, they're the ones who keep yelling Wendigo. Wendigo. Sounds like we haven't seen the last of them. They say Fin Fang Foom is a foe unlike any one could imagine. I mean, he's basically a dragon from the fairy tales on Earth. Ridiculous. This is not some Terran tale of fairies. He is a great reptilian beast, gifted with flight and rage so hot he breathes fire. Right. My mistake. 